WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Monday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell. And we got markets starting off in positive territory. Dow futures up 215 points or about 9 tenths percent, trading 23,866. S&P futures up 26, that's 9 tenths percent as well, trading 28.55. NASDAQ futures leading the way up about 100 points or 1.1 percent in the green, trading right now at 88.69. We'll start things off. We'll start it off with the VIX. Checking out the VIX this morning. We're pulling back to levels we haven't seen in almost two months. Beginning of March with a 35 handle in the VIX. 35.29 actually made it to 34.40 at one point. Jumping over to the charts. We'll start things off with the indices. We'll start it off with the Dow. 23,870 right now. You see the acceleration we had on Friday. Friday early in the day trading at about 23,200. We were just up there near almost 24,000 at about 2 a.m. Eastern time. NASDAQ 100, 88.70, inching towards about 8,900 overnight. There's your S&Ps trading at 28.56. We reach a high at about 1.45 a.m. of 28.64, so within about 10 points of that price level. Crude oil falling out of bed yet again. If you thought last week the pain was over in terms of negative volatility, maybe you thought crude had found a bid. Not so much. Last night, you make it as high as 16.77, right after the futures open, and we've fallen out of bed completely as we're now about $4 below that price level with crude trading at $12.80. Euro US dollar back above 108 at 108.50 and the gold contract trading at 17.37, pretty close to unchanged from where we closed out last week, which was at about 17.44. You see the fall off on Friday, giving back some of the recent gains on gold. What else we have going on this week? A big week of earnings. There's a nice chart of what we have going on. So we got Google as in Alphabet on Tuesday. Wednesday, you get Facebook and Microsoft. Thursday, you get Apple and Amazon. And I believe we also get, let me scroll. Yes, we get Tesla on Wednesday as well. And then you're going to get Boeing on Wednesday as well. Almost one-fifth or one-fourth of S&P earnings coming this week alone. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Larry Pesavento coming up live with Trade What You See from 9 till 10. Should be an interesting market open. We'll see what happens with oil. Oil down 23% right now for the day. The day is young, as they say. Stay tuned, folks. Larry at 9. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Fast Market at 11. Basil Chapman, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien all this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up right now.